What's going on guys, this is Amadi back again with weekly Rust skins videos and this is going to be the fastest Rust item store investing video I've ever made. So essentially um, these are what the top sellers are and I'm not going to recommend investing in anything off of the limited store simply because everything is too expensive. I do think the black diamond set is going to um, uh, be a nice looking set in game but I don't think it's going to perform well because it's so expensive four dollars and sixty cents each skin unfortunately i'm busy so that's why this video is going to be so quick um moving over we have the adobe furnace um no one really cares about um these skins let's be real the only people that are going to buy the adobe furnace are the people that have the adobe um uh stone skin and even then they're probably going to be using a furnace skin that um they prefer more so not going to recommend investing in the black diamond or the adobe um, Black Diamond is just too expensive and the Adobe is just, no one cares about it. Moving over to the Beyond Reason wooden door. This is actually a sick wooden door skin, but it's $3.85 and it's a wooden door skin. If this was a sheet metal door skin, I would recommend investing in it. It's not a sheet metal door skin, it's a wooden door skin. It's going to get replaced within seconds when you're actually playing Rust. Not going to recommend investing in it. Moving over to the Heater AR. Moving over to the Neon Lighthouse door, going for $3.85, this is a cool looking door skin, it does look nice at night, but it also looks a little bit pixelated, and that is not really the skin creator's fault, that is more so just the fault of the game. Um, overall, not going to recommend investing in it, it's $3.85, we already have so many glowing door skins, it doesn't really matter. Moving over to the Neon Wire Bow, do you want to pay to lose skin, do you want to get your cheeks absolutely clapped? Well, this is the place to do it, unfortunate timing with that one. Uh, not going to recommend investing in that. All right, moving over to the Quarantine Rock. Not going to recommend investing in that. The Quarantine uh, set looks cool, but it's just never performed well, and that is going to continue with that. There's no way that this is actually really happening. All right, moving over to the Rust Adam Stores Ultramarine Garage Door, going for $4.60. It's a cool-looking door skin, but I don't think it's stand out enough to actually perform well. Plus, it's also above standard store price for even glowing deployables, sitting at $4.60, so I'm not going to recommend investing in it, and I don't think it's going to perform well on the Rust Adam Store. Um, it does uh, sit at number one on the top sellers, so people do clearly like it, but I do still think it's not going to have any demand once it leaves Rust Adam Store and goes to community market. Does the set, um, is the set going to continue P potentially? Um, but even if it does, I just think it's just like it's it's just another glowing skin. It's nothing crazy. It's not blowing my mind. I don't think it's going to perform very well. Not going to recommend investing in anything off of this Rust Adam store. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and remember, have a skits one.